Uh, Brandon Katz says, Brad Holmes inherited the Lions' offensive line. Any GM drafting where Holmes drafted would have taken Sewell in the first round with a top 10 pick. All right, so but what I about the rest the of the team? Line. What about, hey, even if that point that point is taken and we're not going to say what the offensive line has done with guys like Dan Skipper and Evan Brown and and Jonah Jackson and these guys develop, and what about the whole team he's put around mm-hmm. with drafting guys on their first contracts, guys that are making plays, guys that are winning you games? No, I, I heard an ESPN analyst who was supposedly up for the Lions job talk about who he would have taken and it would not have been Panay Sewell. So you can't say anybody in that position would have taken Panay Sewell. You're right, Terry. Absolutely. Uh, and the, uh, this uh, this Lions v. Giants debate has raged on in, in the chat as well about, you know, yeah, the the Giants the Giants roster is in worse shape than the Lions roster. That's true, especially given the cap situation. Because you know why that is, too? I Brad know, Holmes? I know. Yeah. I, I, me, me. <laughs> uh, yes, get, uh, Mr. McCarty yeah, in the yeah. back. Almost Ross St. Brown makes less in this month than Kenny Galladay <laughs> does his... Er, Kenny Galladay makes more this month, probably this week, than no, 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 no. Ross St. Brown makes in his whole contract. Yeah. No, no. <clears throat> Kenny Galladay makes more in one quarter... Then Amon St. Brown will make in the next 10 years. <laughs> yeah, it's something along those lines. <laughs> right. But see, Sign here's the thing, though. That's, that might be a little bit stretching it. Maybe eight years, Tear. Okay. Yeah, but, but here's the thing, though, too. When Brad Holmes was getting all this ish from everybody about the lack of activity in free agency, including a lot of people in the media in this town, a lot of people that didn't understand how things work, Dot dot dot, Terry. You know the people I'm talking about. I when do. he was when he was getting a lot of criticism for his lack of activity and free agency, what was he doing instead? Instead of being active in free agency, he was cleaning the house. He had to clean the house. You had to eat the Jamie Collins and the Trey Flowers that ish sandwich. You had to eat it, and you had to finish your plate before you could get dessert. Had to. Right. He That's addressed true. it. That's why. That was part of all this. And you're still not through it, by the way. You're still not all the way through it. It'll be better next year, but it still won't be right. 2024, it'll be right. You see what I'm saying, guys? Like, you can't. It takes time to cook this meal, man. If you're going to do things the right way. Now, what the Lions used to do back in the day is they would start eating their peach cobbler before they were done with their peas. And it messed up the whole meal. They never ate their peas, bro. You can't tell me they ate their veggies because the, the bad things that Brad happen Holmes are only happening veggies. to people that don't eat their vegetables. Just saying, don't clean their plate. They put it. They used to just throw the greens on the floor, try to get the dog to eat it. Now they're doing it the, the right way, Neil. Sitting down there eat, eating that, doing it in the right order. Right. And, and you can't say that. Terry Foster told you that this is the best GM the Lions have ever it had. Is. And the dog is not going to eat greens. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's what I but you keep, but right? <laughs> Terry, to that point, banging right. yourself head against the wall for the last 50 years mm-hmm. of thinking that the dog is going to eat it. Finally, Brad Holmes come in and go, dogs right. don't eat greens. You're going to have right. to eat it yourself. <laughs> Uh, DCP1, Brad hasn't done anything dumb, and that's why he's good. Let's see what he does in free agency. Yeah. It's not <laughs> – he hasn't – Do you guys not, like, look at the drafts? Like, do you, do you not see what he's gotten out of the draft in the fourth, fifth, sixth rounds? I'll like, give him t- – you know what? God. I'll give it to you. All right? Because I, apparently we have to go back down. We have to go back down this road. So I'll give it to you. Here we go. His first draft, Panay Sewell. Round number one, Levi Anzarike. Nah. Ali, Aline McNeil. Good. Melifamu. Yeah. Amon Russ St. Brown. Bam, 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 bam. Derek Barnes. Good. Good. And Jamar Jefferson, seventh round pick. You got yeah. four or five of them playing. All right. Second draft. Aiden Hutchinson. Yeah. Jameson Williams. Bam, 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 bam. Josh Paschal. Bam, bam, bam. Bam. I don't know about bam, 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 but it's yeah. <laughs> that one's going to work out. Watch. It's going to work out. Yeah. Kirby Joseph. Bear, bear, bear. Bear, bear, bear. James Mitchell. Bear, bear, bear. Tight end. Uh, he's good. I don't know about that. Yeah, no, bear, bear, bear. he's good. Uh, Malcolm Rodriguez. Bear, 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 bear. Oh, bear. boom. James Houston. Bear, 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 bear. Oh, dog. Come on, guys. Chase Lucas was the other one. 
seventh round picks. Practice squad. Yeah. Depth piece. Like, I don't know what else you guys need. And by the way, like that, let's see what he does in free agency. You're not all the way home yet. I'm telling you that <laughs> Is already. It, and you don't. From am I seeing this right? But it's probably not about this year in free agency. No, nope. isn't it two years? It's a 2024 game, man. That's that's what he's waiting for. 2024 game. It's all set up. I mean, if we're talking about free agency, I know these are small moves, but they made a couple of flyer moves like Deshaun Elliott. That has worked out really well. He's their second. He's Lions' second leading tackler, and even DJ Chark. Isaiah I, Bugs. Yes, Isaiah John Bugs. John Kaminsky. Ab- absolutely, and I mean DJ Chark. That was a move that we all kind of looked at as ah, it was kind of a disappointment, but we're moving off of him after this year. In the two best games Jared Goff has played all season against Jacksonville and Minnesota, DJ Chark, you could argue, was his primary target, his deep threat. So. Even guys like DJ Chark and Deshaun Elliott have contributed to a team that could make the playoffs this year, and those were low-risk Brad Holmes free agent yes. signings. Even even if he never played, he was done in less than three weeks. Yeah, with no have, further commitment. Yep, and they have played and they've contributed. So you can't even say that he hasn't done anything in free agency. He's taken what the what was given to him and kind of turned diamonds, you know, kind of like turned like diamond in the rough type players into into diamonds. Yeah. It's, it's been. I mean, give give uh, the man his credit. Tom Kennedy. <laughs> See, I, I think people have free agency in the NFL twisted. You don't just sign free agents at this stage of a rebuild. To me, free agency, uh, at this stage, you get the little mid-level guys or a guy that's going to fill out your roster. You don't go out and get a big you, splash. You do like when the Cowboys signed Deion Sanders. I like that one. You you see what I'm saying? Like that right. that's what you do. You go mm-hmm. put you go set it off. Set it off, set it off, Jada Pinkett. That's what you do. Mm-hmm. That, that, that's how that works. Uh Robert Closia, Neil, only sixteen Quintricias on the roster, plus five on IR. Of course. Yeah. All right. Of, of course there are. You getting there. And there's right. only one person over the age of thirty years old on the roster. So and Michael Brockers. Yeah. And still one of the youngest teams, correct? The youngest team. The youngest team. Oh, so you look at yeah. you even got that going. Yeah.